Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Samantha and today I'm sharing with you Revolution's latest releases and will I be picking any of them up? So the first is a highlight palette from Obsession and it's called So Lit and it looks like this. So it's that gradient packaging. So you've got uh, bright pink at the bottom going up to a very light cream. This palette retails for £10 and like I say, it's a highlight palette. You're getting in here nine shades. So you're getting nine shades and um, you're getting all manner of shades in here. So if you want a um, gold highlight, you've got it. If you want a baby pink highlight, it, you've got it. Um, if you want a deeper toned highlight, you've got it. In fact, this palette has got it all, everything. And you can see from those shades, you've got everything in here. I also love the formula from Obsession across the board, whether it's their eyeshadows, obviously in this case, their highlight. I don't know if they've actually um, brought out any other highlight palettes. From memory, I think it's all eyeshadow but it's that kind of sized palette, um, like the previous, um, like the, I suppose the size of the Belle Jordan eyeshadow palette. That's what it looks like to me. You are also getting a mirror within that palette, and I hope that I've mentioned it already, but it's 10 pounds. I really like Obsession because you can pick it up in boots, so it's really handy to obviously, you know, check it out in person. But yeah, really, really like the um the look of this will i be picking it up i'm not sure just because i mean i love the look of it and i really like the fact that you've got so much in here so you've got that really light um highlight going to a deeper tone um and you've got that gold which i love as well um the only problem i find with highlight is that um all highlights tend to look very very similar to me on me um once i've applied it i don't necessarily get that different look um from a shade um, but I don't know, they look beautiful. I think it's one of those um, that I'm gonna have to check it out in person. But um, obviously, if I put on a deeper highlight, yeah, I would tell the difference. But you know, the ones that suit my skin tone, if I apply it, I don't know, I, I don't often see the variation from the shade. Um, but these all look beautiful, and like I say, absolutely love their formula. Okay. That's the first item, so it's a highlight palette. They have released something else um, in the form of an eyeshadow, also from eyeshadow palette, also from Obsession, and it is called, if I can get it up on the screen, um, it is called Sweet Like, and if you love cherries, you're gonna love this packaging because the whole <laughs> outer packaging is made up of cherries and it looks stunning let me just i'll press something let me go back i've been having a lot of problems with the revolution website and i'll speak more about that when i get on to the last collection of products so this is the outer packaging of their sweet like palette and it gives you, well, from looking at the packaging, it really gives you an idea of what's inside. Um, also, I really like these um, palettes because they are six pounds and you're getting 10 shadows. So 10 shadows, six pounds, and the formula is just outstanding, beautiful. So there's the actual inside of the palette. So you've got a hot pink there, you've got a red. Now from looking at it, um, I think you're getting a couple of formulas in here, but from the pictures, it looks like it could be half and half. So um, five matte, five shimmers, but don't hold me to that just because um, I can't obviously um, give you 100% accuracy with the um, with just pictures. But you've got that hot pink, you've got a silver, you've got burgundies in here. So this could be a, a really beautiful transitional palette. And for six pounds, love it. 
Also with the um, palette that I shared with you a moment ago, the highlight palette and this eyeshadow palette, you'll see that there's little half moons there. So you can actually remove the pans. So whether you want to mix and match the shades, obviously the only difficulty with that is that the um, shades all have names there. But obviously if you want to, you can, or if you um, purchase a couple of these because you love these palettes so much, I'm talking about the same, then of course, if you use one shade up in particular you can then obviously just pop in another one if you purchase a couple of these um, palettes so yeah really like that but like I say the formula on these are just beautiful um, it could be that they've got a, a three I don't know three or, or more formulas in here for, but from just looking at it I can see shimmers and I can see mattes and it looks like a half and a half and for six pounds love it I also love the picture on the front cherries beautiful now this is where it gets difficult because they have released some more shades to their lip wardrobes now <laughs> their lip wardrobe consists of um, sheer lip products um, matte liquid lipsticks you have got some gloss and you've also got some regular lipsticks you know lipsticks in a bullet so they have added and i think it's 12 new shades um, what I'm going to do because and I'll tell you why I find it so difficult to manoeuvre around the website so I'll just get um, a picture that I've taken so I can read out all of the shades and then I'll give you a couple of um, you know what they actually look like sorry I've just got a message on my phone um, okay so the 12 new shades are you are getting a ruby which is classic red of course you're getting rouge which is red with a pink twist you're getting plum which is a berry plum you're getting the shade excess which is a coral red you're getting destiny which is a vibrant red you're getting decadence which is a hot coral you're getting cutie which is a hot pink you're getting cupcake which is a pink nude cherry which is a cherry red Vixen, which is a mulberry purple. Violet, which is a pink nude. And Vampire, which is a wine purple. Now, um, I've brought up a couple of the shades from um, the Sheer collection. Um, and this is what one of them looks like. I mean, oh, doesn't that look beautiful, that shade? Let me just see if I can work out which shade it is. This is, um, in fact, what I'll do is I'll, I think the shade is called Cupcake. It's either Cupcake or it's Cutie. No, I think it's Cutie, yeah. Um, the reason I had to do it this way is because it is such a palaver to actually get the shades up on the website. Um, I also picked out this red shade um, and it looks like this. So if you love reds and if you love pinks, you are going to love all of the new shades. Now I haven't taken pictures um, of all of the shades um, and I'm going to just go back onto the website and tell you why I found it so difficult. So I'm just gonna go into a shade now, like I say, within all of these shades, you are getting a sheer version, a matte liquid lipstick, a matte lip, hmm, uh, sorry, matte, yeah, matte liquid lipstick, you're getting a matte lipstick within the bullet, and then you're getting a cream formula. That's it, you're not getting a gloss, sorry, you're getting a cream. I knew I was gonna get it wrong. So this is what Cupcake looks like in the sheer it was cupcake that I showed you um, because it's one of those shades that I love so that's cupcake in the sheer I knew I was going to get it wrong um, cupcake in the lipstick I, I find the website such a pain so that's the lipstick then you have cupcake in the liquid matte lipstick 
a nice cupcake in the liquid lipstick and then you've got the cream finish not gloss so forgive me it's just so much to remember with with um, today's video so that is the cream finish which to me the cream lipsticks are um, near enough spot on to um, NYX's soft matte lip creams and they're cheaper okay so I thought I'd tell you or show you what each one looks like but like I say they've got all of those shades brand new shades which I'll go through um, again let me just bring that up again for you so you have I'll just go through it again so you've got ruby which is a classic red rouge which is a red with a pink twist plum which is berry plum excess which is a coral red uh, destiny which is a vibrant red decadence which is a hot coral cutie which is a hot pink cupcake which is a pink nude cherry which is a cherry red vixen which is a mulberry purple uh, violet which is a which is a pink nude and vampire which is a wine purple so those 12 shades have been um, added to their other collections of these these are just added on to the four formulas that they've already released it is so difficult to um, maneuver around that website because when you go into their lip wardrobe the lip wardrobe brings up the old older original shades not these ones so you have to literally search singularly for them now if you want to find all of the new shades um, just put in for example cupcake it will bring up that new lipstick um, and then just um, scroll down to the bottom and it will give you a list of all of the new shades and then you'll need to search for them one by one um, so that's how I did it hopefully they've updated it um, but even if you go into their lip wardrobe which has all four formulas um, it doesn't give me all of the new shades so it's just a heads up for you basically so that's the new releases for today good luck with the revolution website i wish th that what they would do is every time they release something new they added it to their new releases um, that page that you can look at which gives you all of their new releases because this is a little bit of a nightmare not just for me because obviously i want to give you all of the information but me as a consumer i found it really difficult um, so yeah i thought i'd give you the heads up on that um, but really love everything that's brand new just not not liking their website at the moment and believe me I know all about web, about websites because my husband's actually a web designer he um, designs websites and he's very very good at it so yeah <laughs> I do know all about that um, believe me so yeah I thought I would um, give you all of the new releases I would love to hear from you which item or items are you liking um, I must admit I really like the highlight palette this week but like I say I don't think I'm going to pick it up just because I find that all highlights look very similar on me really love the eyeshadow palette um, but I do tend to find that eyeshadow palettes um, I've that kind of eyeshadow palette I've got a lot of shades that look very very similar um, and the lipsticks I've added a few to my basket already and another thing that I've added to my basket is the nail polish more nail polishes I've actually changed my nail polish because I was wearing this one pop last week when we were having all of that heat I've now actually changed my shade to this one which is called gentle and it looks beautiful if you've got a little bit of a tan um, on your feet like I have from the puppy walks this looks amazing um, so I'm definitely going to be picking up some more nail um, polish as well because the collection that I picked up the six shades amazing love them also I've had a few questions about have uh, any of the shades stained my nails I will just show you this I had all six shades on my fingernails during the week I actually left them on there for about 24 hours just to check if there was any staining no staining from the yellow in particular one of you said 
did this stain? No, I've got no staining. It came off with one swipe very, very easily. Absolutely love the nail polish formula and that's why I'm gonna be purchasing more. Um, obviously keep your comments coming in, keep your questions coming in. I will, um, if I can, answer as many as I possibly can. Uh, if I know the answer, basically, I will. Um, also the nail polish is three pounds if you're interested in that. And the neon uh, collection is four pounds. Um, but yeah, I love these absolutely love the um, nail polish gorgeous okay so that's everything I wanted to share with you today um, like I say I'd love to know are you going to be picking any of these up um, and if you've picked up any of the nail polishes that you think the shade I may like the shades let me know because again from the website it's difficult isn't it to to see the shades um, as they should be on the toenail as I wear them or fingernail um, but yeah I'd love love your input um to give me some inspiration on some shades that i may like so yeah keep all of the comments coming obviously if you're brand new to my channel um i would love it if you subscribed um to watch future videos i will be back now on friday i'm still sticking to the monday wednesday and friday and perhaps in the next well i may let you know why i've had to do that um but at the moment it's a little bit difficult a little bit tricky for me but you never know I might feel that I want to share it very soon um, I'll, I'll obviously keep you informed on that um, and uh, you'll know as soon as I post the video but until Friday now thank you so so much for your support thank you so so much for watching my videos and I'll see you now on Friday thank you so much bye <laughs>